How's it going? You know, I thought that was a bot for a second. Because I'm just used to it being the bot. And you normally do it pretty early on. Didn't expect that to be you. <laughs> Not yet. So we have a couple of things that I want to do today. We have a couple of quests here, some of which we can actually finish, believe it or not. And I wanted to definitely try to get some progress on the main story. Um, so I think what we're going to do first, we're going to do this quest here, What Matters Most. Head to the far side of Wreckham Moor in Torna, where lies the place known as the Behemoth Roost. Not 100% sure exactly where that is, but we do have the compass which can help guide us, even if it's just a little. Which, you know, you see 220 meters away. It's not terribly far. This bastard blocked or resisted my break. Please, for the love of Christ, there we go. Thank you. No, I don't want to fight. Fuck you. Go away. Oh no. Now, this is what I call a real predicament. It looks pretty vicious. Did the boy really enter its den? I'm impressed he left alive that all. Buzz was born under a lucky star. The manor is full of anecdotes about things like this. He's a fourth wraith man. Something... You, you seem awfully calm about this. What will you do if we can't get the key back? Eh, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Anyway, the things that matter the most aren't inside the vault. Oh, really? I know where you're going with that, but I'm sure there's still plenty of things in there that do matter a bit. And I'm not letting you lose that. Thank you, Laura. Looks like it's still upset about our friend wandering into its den. We'll have to draw it away somehow. Or defeat it where it stands. It'll seem like the only- to be the only choices. Well, in that case, we'll draw it away with food. Hey, say we did want to lure it away. What could we use? Someone could act as a decoy. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? Let's maybe just use food. We could use- we could take down some herbs armus. Some should be grazing nearby. Ah, brilliant. You most likely form part of its diet anyway, so it won't look suspicious. You've got a good head on your shoulders. You know, we're not mercenaries because of our looks, right? No, oh, I never thought this would be how we'd use the experience. Herbs armors, right? Fine, let's get this over with. Alright. Where are these armors? They're here somewhere. Shall we keep moving? Addictive? Aren't we intrepid? Do we not have ichthyology? You know, the study of fish. Oh, maybe that's a Geon that has that. Mm. Aren't we intrepid? Yeah, it's probably a Geon. I think we've been spotted. Ow. Alright, follow my lead. I won't enjoy this. Yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, Jin is not ready. Ugh, that's that's why it's not switching over. Damn it. Quick heal would be great. Welcome. You haven't missed much. We started a side quest. You know, the guy who lost the key. Yeah, we're going and hunting down that key. And that's about all you've missed. <laughs> Good shit, guys. Technically, we don't even have to finish killing it. Like, that's how good we are at getting his carcass. We got his carcass without actually killing him. Place the bait before they behemoths roost in Torna to lure away the Grafton Ferris. There are two things. Okay. I knew something felt weird about that compass. I'm assuming there's two spots that I have to put these. Alright, let's put down the bait. Now, let's get the key while it's occupied. Go, 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 go! Behemoth's roost. Alt key. This is becoming addictive. Oh, no entomology either. Cool. Fine. Deliver the vault key to Vez, waiting in Aletta's military garrison. Quick and easy. Especially when skip travel is a thing. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. She's something of an expert. So I've been I've been playing a lot of base game. Oh, it's the key! No mistaking it. Try not to drop it in any more deadly, dangerous places, okay? Yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, about that, Vez. I've been thinking it's high time you took some time off. You don't have to take it that far. No, I think it's important, actually. You know that herb you've been picking. Clear break crest, no. The remedy it's a remedy for diseases of the blood. Ah, uh, th that's Ah, you did say you were picking the herbs for your grandmother. Clear break crest is quite rare. I hear that it's used only to treat the gravest of affliction. That why you went to those lengths. You needn't worry about your duties, just hurry home and tend to your grandmother. After all, nothing is as valuable as good health and family. Lord Adam, you're too kind. Well, that's the most valuable thing that's not found in vaults, eh? As long as you're alive, there is hope in all things. What could be more precious than that? 
As you say, Lord, and I accept your punishment and thank you for it. Right, so. If you need anything, I can just grab it from the vault, sir. Ah, indeed. Laura, is there anything you need? What? You've only come this far thanks to you. Speak, and your wish shall be granted. You're kinda putting me on the spot here. How about a recipe for some really delicious meal that's been handed down in your family? Laura, is that the best use of a wish? No, but I mean, I'm curious, okay? <laughs> Hunger will get the better of anyone. Well, you heard the Lady Bez. Fetch us a recipe. Whatever else you think we might find useful on our journey, I suppose. Yes, Lord. R straight away, Lord. Here you are, Lord. I picked some... Uh, I picked things out the best I could, Lord. And, uh, your kindness earlier. I'll never forget it, Lord. I'll teach my kids to honor it too, Lord. None in my lineage will ever forget the good turn you did us, Prince Adam. Sir, Lady Laura, ma'am. Wildflower Salad, Serenity Perfume, Koto of Self-Interest, Wing Booster. And another member in the community. Have my thanks. Wait, 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 wait. Where is he? Bez. When I see my grandmother next, I plan on telling her all about you. Better yet, I think I shall write a book so the kids of tomorrow know your greatness. Okay. What matters most? Complete. Glad we were able to help out. Bez was overwhelmed when you brought back the vault key, vowing that his descendants would carry the memory of your kindness forever. <gasps> Bez is not the guy who takes place of Adam in uh, Tantal. Shit, I gotta go around now. I did a stupid. And we'll take the old machine parts, though. Hi, Mithra, where were you? Rogan, is that you? Whoa. Lord Adam, please, a moment. <coughs> hey, he's turning blue. Oh, jammed. Here, drink some water. <sighs> it's like your colors returned. I'm afraid I have no idea who you are, but I owe you my life. Uh, I think you're exaggerating a little there. Not at all. I'd give you something by way of thanks, but I'm afraid it's a difficult time for me right now. Rogan, have you been snitching food on the sly again? Lord Adam, uh, no! Perish the very thought! But what were you doing here, then? Because whatever it was, it sounded awfully like someone guzzling to me. Prince, I was disposing of spoiled food, your highness. You mean you were scarfing down rotten food? That can't be good for your health. Thank you kindly for your concern, but I am fortunate to have a naturally robust gut. Couldn't risk giving this inferior stuff to the resistance fighters. That... sort of makes sense. You could say I was maximizing efficiency by combining food quality management with disposal. If I can quieten, quieten the rumbles of my stomach at the same time, well, that's a tertiary bonus. Yes, Frog, and I get it. You'll stop at nothing to make no things more efficient. As we've just seen, you'll even risk your own life for it. Could you give me the report on the state of our food supplies? Of course. Well, since your highness's recent return, we've been catering for a few more soldiers. We've organized food uh, gathering squads and dispatched them here and there, but sadly, manpower does not suffice. I suppose I bear some responsibility for that. Yeah, we should help out with the catering, too. Indeed. We must do what we can to improve the situation until his mis his majesty returns. Thank you all, you're too kind. Here's a list of our most needed foodstuffs. Two grimdark crabs, four portions of ferrous beast meat, two large lacto nuts, and six measures of weeping flour. That seems easily doable. You should probably get one more of each than he asked for. He's pilfer prone. I guess we have everything we need to start searching. Another entry in the potential members of the community. Apparently not. Complete the quest, feeding an army. Why did it not ask me to... equip that? Because it did when I first got the quest. 
What do I need? Weeping flower. Search the grasslands of Torna and gather weeping flower. Not going to be the mineral deposit, but while I'm here, I may as well grab that. Um, weeping flower is more than likely going to be... It's going to be vegetable flower or, um... What is it called? Oh, piss off. Oh, okay, I guess we're fighting. Because you won't fuck off. God, it's weird seeing numbers not over a thousand. Because like I said, I've been playing a lot of base game. And so I'm just... You, why are you targeting me? There is a tank right there. Flora heals an aching soul. Thank you, Adam and Mithra. We good? Okay, we good. This is becoming addictive. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, it's definitely pl oh, it says it right. The icon is right there next to the name in the stupid thing. Ow! What the piss? Honestly, be targeting anybody other than me, please. Cool, 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 cool. Hey, that actually worked in our benefit. It got us another uh, weeping flower. I didn't want to fight you. I was trying to do the collection point. But I guess we'll fight you. Honestly, we have new voice lines to learn, so we gotta... We should probably focus on the new voice lines. See you later! God, you're fast. You little shit.
Tell me your flowers. Tell me your flowers. You're not flowers. You're tree. Honestly, it's just easier to do this and reload the area. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. Where's the nearest flower? Is that it? I think that's it. No, that's vegetable. Makes that one flower. This is becoming a nature make. There we go. Head back to Brock Inn. Eh, we'll check the campsite real quick. Hey, Adam. How come we're low on food? Like, aren't you the boss around here? Couldn't you just tax him a little? I'd hate to see you in power. Life is hard here, Mithra. Blood is in the hinterlands of Torna. The population is small compared to the capital. The resistance force is coming in such large numbers. Resources are strained. There's no preparing for it. I only force them to provide for us. And anyhow, taking care of ourselves is the right thing to do. Makes sense, I guess. A little. We'll all need to start doing our bit from now on to try to ease the food supply problem. That's right. It's the only way we'll make we'll be able to manage. Hey, Master Adam. If there's anything you need me and Mick to do, then just holler and we'll do it. I mean, it's not right for us to just reload. We want to earn our keep. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. I think we're going to be just fine. Crafting. Don't spoil your appetite before I'm done. Is that gonna eat up the ones for the quest? Let me turn in the quest before I craft that. And maybe we'll play as Adam and Mithra for a little bit. Welcome back. You managed to get all the food you wanted. Take a look. I'll take the liberty of confirming. Three grim dark crabs, five portions of fair beast meat, three lactonuts, seven measures of weeping flour. Oh, there appears to be even more here than I originally requested. Think of it as a little token of our appreciation, Brogan. Also, if you make yourself ill eating rotten food, it's going to affect the troops' morale. So be sure to eat your fill of this stuff and keep up the good work. Y your Highness, I'm scarcely worthy of such an honor. With this, my devotion is sealed forever. Hey, come on, don't go overboard. Master Adam, would you mind if me and Mick took care of the cooking today? The two of you? Yep. The caterers are looking pretty overworked since all the other people showed up. We should help out. That's very thoughtful of you. Then, I'd be honored to ask for your assistance. Okay, let's get to it, Mick. Hmm, this is good, but it's only a temporary measure. Need to come up with a permanent solution. Feeding an army complete. I'm just happy we made Gathered all the foodstuffs that Brogan asked for. With this, the malicious supply problem should be resolved for now. Mick, mind cutting the veggies? Hmm. Hey, you're pretty good at that. Not really. Anyone could do it. Looks good to me anyway. Then I think I'll get to the meat. Oi! Mithra! Huh? What are you doing? I'm preparing the meat, of course. Are your eyes not working or something? That is way too much salt. Oh my god. Cut it out. Back away and don't touch anything. What? But why? Seems like fun. Why don't I help, too? Don't encourage her. You wouldn't talk that way if you knew the atrocities of Mithra's cooking. Atrocities? It's so bad it needs to be censored.
does more damage to you than any artifice ever could. Hey, watch it! Don't go around saying mean things like that. It's not mean if it's true. Uh, Mithra. Uh, yeah. Can I borrow? What is it? I'm about to help with dinner. I know, that's why I'm pulling you away. You too. Would you mind sparring with me, please? I don't mind, but why don't I help with the cooking? Please, Jin. Fix oh. this mess. Well, alright then. I hope you've been paying attention to Mick, by the way. Thank goodness. Surely it can't be that bad. You could always try it out. Ah, perhaps not. I'll wager nothing tastes as good as a good meal after some solid training. That sounds about right. I ate so much, I feel like I'm gonna burst. Pardon me, Master Adam, sir. While I was giving out rations, I heard the soldiers talking. They, they were saying that Let Bridge still hasn't been repaired. What? Still? We sent workers there a while back. What's held them up? When I hear, Goggles have been giving them no end of grief. But we'd preempted that too. Didn't we send enough guards? Must have underestimated the problem. These goggles sound pretty tough. They're really not. I could see them being a handful in packs, though. For your average soldier, anyway. <laughs> Those things are what destroyed the bridge in the first place. If we don't get that bridge repaired, it's going to seriously delay our going to and from the capital. How are Hugo and Aegean? I believe it may still be a while before they return. Great, then let's go and wrap this whole bridge affair up before Hugo gets back. We'll set out early tomorrow morning. Okay, we'll help you with that. Actually, I might have to pass. Oh, what's wrong? Not feeling well? No, it's not that. It's just, I promised that I'd make my special dish tomorrow. Forget about that! I'll get all the ingredients and what have you so you can focus on helping Master Adam. He needs you! There will be time enough to cook later, after we get rid of the Gogols. We could celebrate our victory! We really could do with the help, Jin. Alright then. Heh, <laughs> or you could just leave all that to me. I'll cook up a Feast of the Ages. No, you flippin' well won't! <laughs> okay then, shall we go clear out the monsters on Let Bridge like we discussed earlier? Where exactly is the bridge? A little ways down from Rickham Moor. It's not that far, not too far. Let's just go and scatter it out a bit. Let Bridge Restoration. Received. I'm certain it'll be worth it in the long run. There is a side quest that just opened. Medicinal Professional, Munga. Ah, I'm glad to see you all. I am but a humble retainer of Prince Adams. Charged with providing medical care to the great army that resides in our beautiful province of Alenta. You can imagine, I don't have enough staff for the job. Nor indeed do I have enough stuff, either. In particular, I'm running dangerously low on penicil penicillin. Penicillin. It's a substance which can be gathered at the Turkey and Cliff Colony. I try I just I tried to just send strong looking militia soldiers to fetch it. Alas, those Orions are so reckless and there's no talking to them. If you're aware of how their fighting style involves self inflicted cuts, well because of that in the end, I wound up using more panacellin than most fools could bring back. It was a complete disaster, let me tell you. And so, to make a long story short, I'd be most grateful if you could find the time to help me out of this bind. The malcontent doctor. I said I'd do it. Consider it done. Consider it done. Okay. So let's go help the doctor real quick. What we this shouldn't take long since it's right here.
Those guys are going to stop me from... So I'm just going to ignore them. Can I just... Squeeze by here? Yes. Yes, I can. I cannot believe that worked. Doesn't seem so bad. There? Interestingly not aggroing. Ow. I'm gonna wager a guess and say there's probably penicillin over here. This takes me back. Nope. Oh. I'm on a what stealth mission. Here? Damn it! We were doing so good. Good shit. Alright. I'm gonna have to ignore. Okay. We're doing okay. Adam just has access to infinite uh, driver combo time because of his talent art. Uh, his talent art is just straight up extend driver combo. Mind giving me a break? Laura, can I have a break? I guess I don't need it. This takes me back. Nature. You're mine now. What? Oh, probably the Luxon video. I just got a notification on my phone that somebody liked a comment, and the comment that it was was, "I've been waiting excitedly for this," and I'm like, "What the?" fuck video was that on? And from what I could tell, it's the 75 minute... Um... Not that kind of break, Patrick. You're mine now. What have we got here? Nature. Uh, there's a 75 minute... Uh... Analysis of the Xenoblade 3 trailers for the from that direct earlier this month. Can you thank you. That's a unique monster. I don't know that I'm leveled up enough to take it, but I'm gonna try. I won't enjoy this. Oh, I'm fucking dead. Okay, somebody please wake me the fuck up. This was a mistake. We'll avenge ourselves next time. Ugh. 
Alright. This is doable. It's gonna be rough, but it's doable. Please be careful. Do not aggro the fucking unique monster, thanks. And he's been... okay. Oh, Jin is dead. Jesus, Mithra, what are you doing? Shut up, Mithra. But still, we need a new strategy. I will be back for that. I guess. Someone's pleased to see us. Shut up, Adam. Is it just me? Or are there more enemies here? Curious, how many level ups can I get? I fight for my friends. Oh no. And while we're here... We don't know Malos' location right now, and we have a little time until Hugo gets back. We'll have to take care of those goggles so we can, so that the repairs for the Lep Bridge can continue. You're right, we should make that our immediate objective. So these goggles, are they tough? One of the fiercest species in the area, for sure. Bet if I got serious with them, they'd fall in no time. Hey, be serious. If you really went at it, you'd probably destroy what's left of the bridge. Hey, that's not true. Um, uh, well, okay, maybe it is true. You would blast it right off into the horizon. That bridge is a vital link to the capital. You can't really get in or out without it. So we've really got to get rid of those goggles. But I'll have to ask you to go a little easy on them, Mithra. Yeah, whatever. Hey, Doc. I, uh... I may have gotten my ass beat a few times, but I did get you all of the penicillin. Well, color me impressed! You brought it all back, and not so much as a scratch on any of you. Exceptional work, anyway. Really wish those militia louts would learn some things from you all. It'd make my life easier, at least. But perhaps I shouldn't be comparing simple foot soldiers with hero great heroes of your kind. In any case, thank you for your help. This should keep us going for a while. Community. The medicine you brought us has saved numerous lives already. My thanks. I knew you were a man of the people, King, uh, I mean, Prince Adam. <laughs> you now collect penicillin whenever you like. Malcontent Doctor. Complete! Good enough for you? you? Gathered the penicillin and delivered it to Mungo. With any luck, it shall last him a while. Alright. For real this time. A slog. Bridge Restoration. What did you need? Report back to this guy at Gormont. Yeah, okay. Sure. Since it's just turn-in quest done. If there was more to it, I'd be like, maybe not, but... Skip a 
and a jump later. Excellent work. I could tell you performed the five bleed combos I asked for. Report the good news to Roly Poly, my driver. I hand it to you. You passed the preliminary test with flying colors. Oh, didn't I tell? Oh. Oh. Fuck you. Blade coaching complete. Always happy to put a smile you successfully completed the trial, but it seems that Krogane wasn't done testing you yet. Why not try his next challenge on for size? Okay, fine. Okay. Finest... Five of your finest three stage blade combos. Blade combo is a string of specials above... Okay. Okay. Further blade coaching received. What a jerk. Okay. Fine. Adam would never talk down to the people like you. I mean, there's a difference. I'm not royalty or anything. I'm just a dude. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. And y'all are just regular people too. So there's a certain level of we're on the same level. What have we got here? Adam is royalty. And I should probably um make this the active quest again. So I know where I'm going. And here I thought we were being inconspicuous. Hello, Goggles. Look, there's a bridge. I guess that's Lep Bridge. It's certainly beset by monsters. And they look rather tough to boot. You think? They don't look like much to me. Well, our analysis doesn't change the facts. The bridge is blocked. We've got to clear it. Don't let your guard down, everyone. And here I thought we were being inconspicuous. Oh, we're targeting this one. Why am I being targeted? So he said we're not being, uh, we are not being graded on, what are they called? Critical routes. But I think I accidentally triggered one anyway, oops. Someone die? Is that what I saw? I thought I saw somebody die. So this is one of the things that I find so much better about the, um, the Torna combat system compared to base game. You can get orbs up so much easier. It's so much it's so much nicer, and combat just moves so much smoother. Phew, we managed it, just about. Alright, they were a little tougher than I expected. I did think that you were underestimating them. At any rate, the restoration of the bridge can begin now. That's right, thank you for your hard work, everyone. Laura, when we get back to camp, what would you say to a little more training? 
Uh, sure, but we only just finished fighting. That's exactly why I asked. We don't temper Mithra's skills a tad. I'm somewhat apprehensive of the battles to come. Hey, wait a second. Just what is that supposed to mean? Notice you're getting a little, well, careless, to be frank. You need to be more mindful, or we'll never beat Malos. Careless? Mindful? Gee, thanks for the personal attack. Slow down there. What's gotten into you? Nothing's gotten into me. It doesn't matter how much we train. I'm not going to magically become more mindful. The end. Let's go home. Why is she so angry? Let bridge restoration. Complete. You can rest easy now. now that the Gogols have been driven away, the work on rebuilding the bridge can continue apace. Beltane Blade. Ooh. Terminal Flash, Everybody. level 2. Alright, well, let's head back to the campsite and see what we could do. Because we do have some crafting that we kind of that I kind of ignored earlier. Never mind, just cutscene happens first. Amazing, Laura. Even when I foresee your movements, you counter me instantly. I couldn't do it without Hazel's power. What about you? I don't see you using Mithra's hidden ability. And what if we did? Well, if you did. I just have to bring out my original blade. Master Adam. Your evening meal is ready for you. Oh, is it that time already? The days are so long at this time of year. I just start losing track. Finished already? That's a shame. I was hoping to join in. Join in? By yourself? His Majesty has many pressing matters to attend to. Besides, I'm used to working alone. A driver and blade are one in body and soul. That's their very nature. You're not at full strength without him. It's not so simple as all that. I know I've yet to unlock the depths of your power. Really? I feel like I've been giving it my all. But you never stop growing. At any rate, Hayes's ability to restrict other blades is indispensable. It's perfect for training. We're lucky. When she stops me using my foresight, it's certainly difficult. Oh, but you honor me too much. I'm just happy to help you both in any way I can. Next to each other like that, you really do look like twins, you two. It's rare for the driver's nature to appear so strongly in their blade. People tell me that from time to time, but is it really true? Perhaps. But whatever the reason, I am happy if I look even a little like you, my lady. We're even the same dress size. Right? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, we want to try taking you on next, Jin. Well, how about it, Jin? I'm afraid I don't particularly like fighting. And to think we're hearing that from the strongest man in Torna. But perhaps there's truth in those words. After all, he, or rather, they... My lord, my lady, we've discovered Malos's target. The capital. What? Are you sure? Yes, no doubt about it. Uh oh.
malice. And here I thought I had seen the last of you. Now, now. I never meant our parting would be forever, you know. I've just been to see the Torn and Titan. I bet it'd be real interesting to see it in its true form. Where did you learn that? Learn? Inside my core, I have all the data of all Blades and Titans. You have all of it? You think to call yourself the Master Blade? Sure, why not? Sounds good. So, exciting, right? Hmm. My partner. I hear you gave her to that torn in prince. And if I did, you'd erase me? Just like that? Not at all. I have a much better idea than that. I've decided my next target is Torna. Why would you tell me so plainly? So you know what to look forward to as you watch. Damn, Melos. Fuck's sake. I see. So this comes from the Quester. But he doesn't know what Malos is planning for Torna. We should probably hurry. Soon. We'll go once Hugo's back. Guess who's back? Good to see you again, everyone. Hugo, have you finished surveying the battleground? We have, and we came upon something of grave importance. You're looking a bit pale there, Hugo. Are you alright? I'm just a little tired, that's all. I'm not surprised. The sea and resistance fought so desperately, they really took it out of us. The battleground was a terrible sight to behold. Many more lives was Mallow's rest from us. We must do all we can to avenge them. It is truly tragic, chick. We'll put a stop to it. Come on, they prepared to let bridge while you were away. I think it's time for us to move on. Move on? Have you discovered where Malus will strike next? Indeed. We have our suspicions, and now that they've been confirmed. His target is the Torna. The capital, no less. Can we trust can we trust the veracity of the source? I believe we can. The Praetorium's intelligence is likely to be on the mark. Our info is coming from the Quester then. In that case, I believe we have little room for doubt. Capital, huh? That's a long way. It is. Once we're over Let Bridge, we'll have to cross the Dana Desert. What do you want to do, Mick? You could stay here if you want. We can have one of the Wardens look after him. I'll go with you. Are you sure? Sooner or later, we'll end up facing Malamus. It's a dangerous road that lies before us. I'm going with you. Mick Isle. What should we do? Thinking about it now, there is no guarantee that his staying here would assure his safety. He may, in fact, be safer in our company. Is that not so? Can we let him come with us then? Talk about twisting a person's arm. Fine, we're all going to the capital. Are you sure this is what you want, Mikhail? Mm-hmm. Hugo, I have a proposal for you. Oh yes? I've been thinking. After the spawning match with Laura yesterday, wouldn't we also make better use of our skills if we pass around our weapons the way she does? How about it? Want to give it a go? Perhaps it's worth a try. Laura has access to both Jin and Hayes' weapons while when fighting. It's sure to open her options in battle. I do think it would be wise for us to learn from her, especially given our coming battle with the Aegis. So we're agreed. Mithra, I'd like to try using your sword. Mind if I borrow it? It's all yours. I doubt you're gonna do as well as those three, though. Strangely humble of you. That's not what I meant. Actually, forget what I said. We're gonna knock this out of the park. Now that's more like it. Bridget Ajian, you may not be so convinced at first, but give it time and we will surely reap the rewards. As you wish, your majesty. 
I would never question your authority, your majesty. Thank you. So blessed to have faith such faithful attendants. Make tracks, people! We'll be right with you. Onwards then, to the capital. Yes. This is how they figure out how to use blade weapons properly. All teams level 4 specials are now available. Unfortunately, nothing in the immediate area is strong enough to let us get up to level 4. Not reliably, anyway. Except maybe that unique monster. You know what? I'm gonna test out Adam and Mithra's level 4s with the unique monster. Laura, how did you do that? Scowling Quincy. God, he's still hitting me very hard. Bridget, motherfucker, you're dying. Oh, he resisted the top. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's no, that's no bueno. Please let me switch, please. Oh, I'm dead. Someone res me? Someone res me? Someone? Thank you, Jin. Oh, our tank is dead, that's why. Oh, okay. Um... Oh. I... Did I get rezzed? And then... I looked away for a second, because I was reading chat thinking, Oh, I'm gonna die any second now. Time to delay, but still, we need a new strategy. Okay, look, you make that mistake twice, and we're done here. Give me one second. One second. No, nope, that's too much blue. Still a little too much blue, so maybe if I do that a little. No, nope, that's not enough. How's that one? Getting there. You need to be a little bit of a brighter and then a little low. How's that? That looks a little ugly. And also, still a little too much. Can you lower that a touch more? And then that. Oh, wait, this one. Nope, 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 nope. Up. Okay, so then you need. That'll do for now. I might tweak it later. And god damn it, my fucking webcam did the thing again. Here we go. Okay, where were we? Oh yeah. Heading to the capital. What have we got here? Nature makes a fine ally. Yeah, I'm gonna have to to, to fine-tune that uh, uh later. And here 
to get it, like, perfect, because it still seems a little... It seems like a little too much blue and not enough lights, if that makes sense. Hi, Ardoon. Fuck you. Well, Welcome to Let are. Bridge. I say we rest a bit. Who's in? That thing will probably. Let's keep it short, Master Ash. My friends, the Titans at me. Can I have a break, please? Oh, wait. I'm trying to get my level 4 specials. That's right. Wait, did I get toppled? How did I get toppled? Here's Mithra and Adam's level 4, started by Mithra. That wasn't bad. Switch to Jin and get the- thank you. Ah, I missed the timing, damn it. Get that level 4 going? Okay, I'm getting fucking thrown. Very similar, just a slightly different ending. Because Adam ends up with the sword again. Or in control, rather. Now we could do the Hugos. Uh, once we find something I want to do it against. Hi there. A sly jackpot. It's a Lethalian monster, do not Worry about that later. Come on! That took no time at all. There we go. So let's take a quick look at Hugo's level 4. 
Not till the fish jumps. It's over. a job my prince i thought i told you to stop calling me that a blade he's minox questor of malthus's blade and malthus's <sighs> he's one of the questors in indo and malos driver Our formation has changed. Minoth is now part of Team Adam. Contributing to a blade combo will cause elements orbs to start orbiting the enemy, and then destroy them and inflict other special effects by using a chain attack. Press plus on your uh, when your party gauge has all three bars full to launch an attack sequence where the team takes turns hitting the bow and an element orb with specials. When an orb is hit three times, it will be destroyed. Special of the opposite element to an orb on the enemy will count for two hits. This last part is key. Here, have a free element orb and party gauge refill. Now that you've got all you need to press plus, trigger a chain attack and watch the sparks fly. Oh, they gave us three. I think that's stone, wind, and water. So let's get a, a chain attack going. Of course, nothing on Team Adam is helpful for the orbs we have. Also, I thought it was stone, not light. Okay. So wait, Minoth would have actually just instantly broke, um... Hmm. Fine. Destroying an orb has a lot of nice effects. It extends the chain attack, raises the damage bonus, fills up the burst, full burst gauge, and recharges used characters. Normally in a chain attack, each team will act once and that's it. But if you manage to destroy an element orb, the attack will be extended by an extra round. If you succeed in the button challenge that appears when the round is extended, the specials you use will get a level up and be recharged, so be ready for it. Any last words? Magnificent. When you launch a chain attack, the party gauge will be replaced by with a full burst gauge for the duration. With each element you destroy, the full burst gauge will fill up a little. If you Fill it completely. A full burst will trigger, dealing massive damage. Additionally, if you defeat an enemy during the chain attack, overkill. Dealing more damage during overkill nets you extra XP, WP, and SP. So... Uh, do I win the 50-50 here? Let's give it a try. I got the 50-50 I wanted. They didn't give us enough to get a full burst, unfortunately, but... Wash, rinse, repeat. Away. 
Jin just always does more damage in a, ch a chain attack. It's great. Let's go, Mithra. I mean, so... Oh shit, Laura just died. So, so changing it is exactly the same as changing... Ah... Okay. We're not done yet. Changing the background is done exactly the same as I expected by doing it exactly the same as the way I changed the color of the frame. That's what I've been trying to say. Second, fuck, I didn't expect to die to that guy. But fucking Laura dropped instantly. Bridget, thank you. Surely somebody else on the team has fucking smash. Damn it, I was trying so hard to get the chain attack in. That was close. Thanks, Minoff. You're very capable, even on your own. Uh, well, maybe I should thank him, or not. Your core looks kind of different. Ah, well, I'm a flesh eater. A flesh eater? A being with human and blade cells, made possible with Judician technology. That's how I can use my full strength anywhere, without my driver. But, I'm pretty sure I'm a failed experiment, so to speak. I never knew blades like that existed. Flesh eaters. 
What of Amalthus? Isn't he coming? Nah. I just heard rumors that you guys had entered Torna. I used my own initiative. Ah. It's been two years since I saw him last. Huh? Too late. Is that right? Was that their child? That soldier? Wasn't that the one from... Such a cruel world we live in. Huh. In Indol, there are a great many paintings depicting all manner of hells. But I think real hell might be closer to something like this. Amalthus, you can't. I had hoped once that the architect might save us all. Since then, I haven't seen him. I heard he went climbing up the World Tree not long after. And brought divine revelations back with him. You mean... The Aegis. Malos. But what kind of revelation is this? What kind of salvation? Could anyone call this salvation? His hope caused this, or his despair. Despair? How about you, then? You're from the same stock? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just following this guy since he woke me up, and that's basically it. I have no particular interest in this world or its future. Yet. And Malice himself? His thoughts I'm especially uninterested in. We've never even met. Please, don't mistake her. Despite the attitude, she's a good kid. The hell is with that tone? Where do you get off acting all parental? <laughs> oh, come on. I woke you up. I make sure you get enough to eat. What? Cloud sea crab sticks are tasty, aren't they? You're very welcome. Although, I don't think I'd have managed to eat six myself. <laughs> what? You counted? I don't know where you put all that. I'm the Aegis. I need all the fuel I can get. Hey! <laughs> you are too easy to sneak up on. Where are my extra rations? Oof. You little... <laughs> the Aegis bested by a little kid. <laughs> Milton, get back here! <laughs> hmm? You know, if the architect really does exist, I'd quite like to meet him. Salvation, huh?
new tips have been added. Your sword swapping fighting style. It's very interesting, you know. It's still quite rough, though. I'm a bit lacking in oomph. It'll take me a while to get it down properly. See, I wasn't actually talking about the power or technique. Oh? What then? That connection you have. Human and blade. It's like a bond of sorts. I just found it curious. An actual... bond? It's like that's how it's supposed to be. <laughs> I don't know. It does make sense. Lady Laura is always with Jin. And you almost never find time to practice with me. It's like he's her favorite. Come on, don't say that. I'm an equal opportunities driver. Liar! You're both my partners and very dear to me. There's no favoritism, swear. Are you really sure about that? I have my doubts. I think Hayes is a bit jealous. I have been with you longer, after all. You think? All right, then. Starting tomorrow, Hayes gets to take the lead. Good? Wonderful! You don't mind? It's all right by me. gonna catch cold the lot of you how did, G how did a GN not immediately turn to see Adam walk away Do you remember? The last time we paid a visit to Indol? Oh hey, it took off her costume. What did you think? She's not wearing pants anymore. About Excellent. Him? In a word, he seems very human, protecting his heart with a mask of lies. Are you curious what's behind it? Not really. Most humans are like that, aren't they? Cutting to the chase, I see. But I hear his achievements in Indol have been quite grand. The refugee protection policies from last year are his work as well. So a hypocrite, then. Isn't that what you call the type? Quite. I hope that's all he is. He smiled. Did you notice? No. I think... he might actually be enjoying this. What? The world in this state. That's interesting. You felt something was wrong, didn't you? That's why you brought me. Don't you think they're worth saving? 
if you think they are, you know you'll have my aid. Even if you disagree? That's not for the likes of me to decide. It's up to you humans. Oh, you mean that time. I remember. What about it? What Minoth said bothered me. I think he was talking about Malos, but his words could just as easily have applied to a Malthus. I suppose. What if all of this is what a Malthus... No. What all of humanity really wants? You don't mean it. Hey. What are we going to do if we defeat Malice anyway? You know. Like I told Hugo, go home and work the land. I didn't get to harvest the Grom rice this year. Well, that might be good enough for you. Hmm. Some others might not be too pleased with that. Hmm. He has point. Oh, hey, it's him. Who is this? Picked him up during a routine core collection. He was one of yours, right? As we discussed, I engaged him as a broker of cores, but no more. What a waste of a human being. That much is hard to deny. What are you driving at? Waste and refuse can have their own uses, I think. The project we spoke of before. I think it may be time to set it in motion. You mean... a blade eater? His strength will grow exponentially. It will dwarf even that of a flesh eater. And you can control him. Oh, please. Even if we can't, there's no need to worry. After all, this is just a prototype. Sooner or later, the binding will decay and he will die. <laughs> hmm. I hear... He's got some connection to this paragon of Torna, you see. He'll prove useful either way. Torna, then? He's on your mind, isn't he? Malos. Not him, but what comes after. So, you're trying to take down Malos. We must. He's already sunk the sea in Titan. We can't just sit back and let him destroy the whole of Orest. Of course we can, but he's the Aegis man. You can't just go up and try to fight him all on your own. You can when you've got another Aegis in the party. Word. Hmm, even still. In any case, our primary goal is to defend Torna, not necessarily to bring Malos to a grisly end. Perhaps we can even convince him to end this peaceably. You do that. It'll be a damn sight better than getting yourselves killed for no good reason. Ouch. Minoth here is a blade of Amalthus, just like Malos. I'm sure he knows far better about our chances than we do. You say he's being realistic. I am being realistic. If it's Amalthus saying the capital is the target, then it has to be true. You still trust him after everything he's done? Whatever he does, it's for his own benefit. You're just pawns in his game. We all are. It does seem better to act upon the information we do have rather than move around aimlessly. Alright, so what will you do now, Minoth? Now, I join your little traveling troop. How else am I going to keep tabs on you? Ha, <laughs> I suppose so. Going to the capital, I assume you're well equipped for the desert? Well equipped how? 
Oh, so you were just going to go in there and collapse from desert fever. Fantastic. Desert fever? An endemic disease caused by fungi. There's no harm to blades, but to humans it can be lethal. Why haven't we heard of this? Uh, that... I... forgot. Adam, you dumbass! Were you trying to get us killed before we even find Malos? <laughs> Let's see to it that that doesn't happen, shall we? We'll need to get enough medicine for Adam, Hugo, Milton, Mikhail, and me. Okay, we'll have to backtrack a bit, but they should have something back at the resistance camp. If we can collect the ingredients, they should be able to make enough antimycotics for all five of us humans. What do we need? Tawny carrots and nest extract. Extract, I believe. We could get the tawny carrots around the torn grasslands. And to obtain the next extract, we shall have to defeat some million nests. Okay then, let's get going. Across the desert. Received. We'd be more than happy to assist. Okay, I don't know where that is. There's one. There's a lot of things happening right now. Oh, I got toppled. Cool, 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 cool. Why is the tank dead? Take the. Okay. Fuck off, guys. Oh god, there's more. Leave me alone, please. For the love of God. I cannot believe I didn't die. makes a fine ally. I am honored to fight at your side, Adam. Is it your friends? Skin. Think again. I can do that. Understood. I honestly don't know how the timing of um, Minoth stuff is. Yeah. 
Where is Adam? There is Adam. Oh, I don't have a high enough affinity with between Adam and Minoff. Okay. I kind of got to just sit here for a few. Adam, come back. I'm trying to show off our level 4. I need you to cooperate. We're not doing this again. I know what I'm doing. My friends, Richard Mines are here. Okay. There's our gold affinity. Let's get that level 4 going, shall we? This bastard. I can't tell if he died or... What the fuck. Bridget, you might want to switch. Thank you. Why does Laura have such a small HP pool compared to everybody else? That's not what I was expecting. Real quick. Oh, he already has decent, uh... Interesting. I don't want to lose the crit rate on Jin. Hayes, um... Block rate doesn't particularly matter. I'll come back to her. You want as high a crit rate as you can get. So, scale chip. Minoth is better than anything else we have. Bridget, you kind of don't want any of these chips that we have. Geon. I 
guess the cobalt chip, because it's the only thing that's like somewhat of an increase. Twenty nine out of one. Yeah, sure. Does who have armor? You can rely on me. What do I need for you? Trust. Our efforts are paying. I'll be of even more use now. Trust. Hey, if it makes my life easier. Increase trust. Fisticuffs favor the prepared. Increase trust. Think I love to work out how things tick. Increase trust and increase trust. Okay. Check our course. Um You definitely want the swift evasion. Uh Topple resist. Geon. Uh ooh, block right up. Yes. Minoth has three aux core slots, so I'm gonna give him Infinity Max Barrier. Movement heal one. Special level three plus. Uh, ooh, shit. I'm gonna give Gian instead of aggro attack up the arts aggro boost. Mithra, you want massive melee Mithra and blow down or something else. Arts heal. Did I do all of you? Yes. You want... What do you want? Um... You can have an Affinity Max Accuracy. You can have... Auto Attack Stealth. You can have... You can have the Crit Up one. And you can have another Crit Up one, and you definitely want the Affinity Max Attack. Okay. <laughs> And now for arts. Yes. This power is for you. You want that at level two, and then you want this leveled up again. Giving it my all. You. I don't know which one of these you want. This, this one. This should be wild. This work you want to try to level all of these ones. Just you wait for it. This will work better now. Sixty. Three, three, yeah. Just you wait for it. And then. You. I'll make you even prouder. 
So, Lewis, generally... That's gonna be the next one I get. Um... Buh, buh, buh. I grow ever more polished. Adam, your arts. Um, this one's second nature to me now. It Increase the break art always effort to get this good. It takes time and effort to get this good. Um hmm. This one isn't as as clear cut as what I uh, I shall aim ever. Yeah. You guys have your affinity charts. More to add to my repertoire. Excellent. Work hard enough, and our efforts won't be in vain. I must have improved. Okay. What do you mean, the Omnitrix? This is how I'll protect you all. Oh, that was 500. I... Duh. There is still much experience to gain. No? There is still much experience to gain. Accessories. I got I've gotten some. Uh what do you want? Aggro reduction by 25% is good. Absorb ooh, absorbs eleven percent of critical damage dealt as HP. Yes. I definitely want Team Adam to be fucking always living. I mean him and Hugo. Buffy hat. I don't have much that I want to give Laura beyond what she already has. I mean, if I can, if I could. Give something better than the attack stone. I guess that. You, my good friend. You want to start battle with aggro. You want to retain aggro if you die. Pouch items. I don't have much. I have some, but not much. Um... Hope I am never parted from it. Pouch items. Really? Nobody liked the waffles? Does Mithra still like sweets? I bet you Mithra still likes sweets. Good for the body and for the soul. How many do I have of the pouch expansion kits? One. I definitely want to get two more. Although I'm not 100% sure where in Torna they are.
Alright, I don't know if I ever actually got this as a skip travel point, because cutscenes are stupid like that. Oh, I guess I, it's just not one. That's annoying. Milton. What's up, Mick? What happens if you get desert fever? Master Adam told me. He said, your lungs get infected and you get sick like you had a cold or something. Oh, well, if that's all it is, maybe it's not much to worry about. Pretty much. But if you're unlucky, it could spread to your skin, joints, bones, liver, and kidneys. And if that happens, get her done. Done? Let's not worry, Mick. I know Prince Adam, and I know he'll get the medicine made for sure. Yeah, okay. I know it'll be worth the wait. Okay. Uh... I think that's somebody's favorite pouch item. It came together nicely. It came Gonna make one nicely. of everything, really. It came together nicely. Just taste it. It's ready. This came out very well. Tales. I'll need to keep that in mind. Whole upa in a bun. Sweet Ferris dumplings. Chaos. Chaos Stralu. Spicy scorpion cookie. Hunger is the best spice, right? So this should be delicious. A happy encounter. Huh. I need one more. I also need to figure out what I need for this. Charged Shaft. Bismuth Slab. Mora Mora Pearl. Shall we get started? I was so self-absorbed. I there. A cologne to cut it. Hmm. Ruska dumpling soup. Does it suit your tastes? How do you like it? Does it suit your tastes? Does it suit your tastes? Okay. I'm actually gonna look up what everybody's favorite pouch items are. Cause I'm curious. Hunger is, in fact, the best spice, but it doesn't work if your food is morality agent. What? Oh, you know what? Goddamn bridge is a warp point. What a pleasant stroll. Right. Where shall we head to next? There's a treasure trove that's been sitting there that I just have not seen. chart real quick. I just did, but I guess I can again.
More growing to do. How have you not gotten your third skill yet? Defeat a caliber scorpox in the Harrod Hills. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna have to go around and start killing random shit, aren't I? Hmm. Okay, let's see. Ouch. Team Adam. Adam likes these. One of his favorite. Okay, so the type in the item doesn't necessarily match. If it does, then it's great, but it doesn't usually. Um, it looks like we don't have either of Adam's favorite items, but we do have his favorite type. Thank you. I'll be sure to savor it. Tasty, delicious. I kind of wish I had waited on that. Goddamn. Adam also likes charms. We don't have the ability to make his favorite charm. Does Minoth like charms? No. Interesting choice, Minoth. Miracle Parfait, Bunnet Stuffed Peppers for Mithra. Not look like we have her favorite items, but we do have, um, we do have a lot of stuff. Do we have <coughs> Minoth's favorite thing? Does not look like it. Minoth, for some reason, really likes, um, really likes perfumes. Ooh, someone's got good taste. Not what I was expecting. <sighs> Laura. She likes meats and talismans. So we have some meats. You have talismans. Never mind, we don't have any. Much less her favorite. I'll come back to this at a later date. Yeah, thank you. I definitely wanted to to lure and not freaking switch to Mithra.
Where's the chapel, guys? Thank you. There's so much going on right now. It's kind of crazy. It's great though that the Switch can do this. I beg to differ, because to me, it seemed like they had you surrounded. Huh? No way! I wiped the floor with them before you came to me. We're riding high. Let's beat this off. Is it just me? Break! Or are there more enemies here? Chain attack ready. Chain attack ready. Okay. There's a level up. This should make for placing exercise. Spinning wheel. Chain attack ready. My friend, is it just my fatigue? Or are there more enemies here? God shit. That is especially classy of me. Did I get enough nests extract yet? Like shit, guys. Across the desert. Return to the garrison. Ask Mungo to make the medicine with the ingredients we got. God. A pleasant stroll. Right. Where shall we head to next? I'm curious. Bear with me a moment. I didn't think so. I know it'll be worth the wait. Wildflower salad. Don't have enough for it though. Anyway, Mungo. Hello there, Mungo. Prince Adam, and your companions by your side. If I may boldly guess, were you so kind as to come here in order to obtain some de desert traversing preparation? Bang on the mark. Here's enough tawny carrots and nest extract for several people's share of remedies. Oh, very good. It never hurts to be well provisioned. You've no idea how touched I am. This cleans me. This cleans not only my heart, but those of the resistance and the people of Aletta. Huh? Looks like you finally found it within your. You to bear the burdens of Torna, your Majesty. Wonderful. Uh, sorry, Mungo. I'm not sure I follow you. I think this day would finally come. The long years I spent waiting for your mess, for your Majesty to ascend the throne. Adam, you aren't thinking of doing anything like that, are you? No, the thought never even crossed my mind. Where's all this coming from, Mungo? Yes, His Majesty the King has a kind heart, no doubt about it. A little too kind at times to do what he must. I feel that many of his subjects long for decisive and resolute leadership, such as the Prince could offer. Prince Adam, if only I could lay claim to such irresistible charisma. Imperial Majesty, what a thing to say. Prince Adam possesses great virtue, but I must humbly assert that your majesty has at least an equal portion. I concur absolutely with a G on your majesty. I really think you're making too much of this charisma of mine. Anyway, I can never usurp a lawful ruler or bloodline. I want to go to the royal capital, but only to protect Torna, not to take it over. Really, that's a terrible shame if you ask me, your majesty. I don't know if you were serious or not there, Mungo. But either way, that kind of talk is unwise, to say the least. Prince Setter is notoriously insecure. If he heard something like that, things could get pretty interesting. Heh, <laughs> interesting. 
It's alright for some. Heh, <laughs> anything's interesting when you could just sit back and watch from the sidelines. Well, I was certainly moved by your declaration of loyalty, Your Majesty. I promise to be a little more discreet about my hopes for you to ascend the throne from now on. You could stop addressing me as Your Majesty. Well then, my good apothecary, but how much can we acquire you of fine desert medicine? Ah, yes, the purpose of your visit. Forgive me, I got a little sidetracked there. I'll just take the ingredients and combine them post haste. And there we are. Desert medicine for five. Thank you, Mungo. Alright then, now at last we can finally cross that bridge and make for the capital. I'll pray for the safety of your journey, your majesty. And stop calling me your majesty. Cross the desert. Complete. Give me a shout next time something happens. So they really have a fireside chat for every freaking story beat. Finally, we set out for the city. Let's hope it's worth the wait. Oh, I can't wait to find out what kind of place it is. Hayes, remember, this isn't a sightseeing expedition. Yes, yes, I know. But surely there will be a little bit of spare time for me and Lady Laura to go shopping. I didn't mean to wag my finger at you, Hayes. Of course, you're the only one who could do that stuff with Laura. <laughs> You could get away with it. More power to you. Actually, Jin, you should come too. We're gonna need someone to carry all the things we buy. Hey, what the fuck? Well, alright. I did kind of want some new shoes anyway. <laughs> oh my god. I love the fireside chats. I really do. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. Alright. For real this time, we'll ascend to, um... Try to make our way towards the desert. This takes me back. Very good. We can stay here for the day. Something wrong? No, but this place is familiar somehow. It feels like it anyway. Is it possible you've been here before? I have no memory of it. But still. Um, maybe you could just have a little walk around. Something might jog your memory. Yeah, maybe so. Welcome to Hyber Village. And we'll do exactly that. We'll have a walk around. Well met there, travelers. Oh, so the repairs to that bridge are finished, are they? We were a sleepy village to begin with, but after the bridge fell, our trickle of visitors dried up completely. I'm glad the bridge is fixed. Hey, if you're planning on crossing the Dana Desert from here, it'd be a good idea to rest up in the inn first. Stuff out there for th in the desert, even for strong drivers and blades. This? Nature makes a fine ally. Hi, Laura. I'm running out of nowhere, dude. I'll investigate. I should check how we're doing on that. The uh the quest for the red pollen orbs. 
We need 70. Christ. I mean, we have about 40, so we're on a decent path there. Monster Granny Martha. Mm-hmm. Certainly rare to meet drivers and their blades. I came here to investigate monsters. Ah, it's quite the life for an old lady. Wouldn't trade it for the world. You seem like reliable young tykes. Maybe I'll tell you about it someday. Want to know more about this village, though? You'll have to ask someone else. I'm just a visitor here. Whoa, cool! It's been ages since I saw Drivers and Blades. The village is so small, it's only got two houses and an inn. It used to be way bigger, but people don't really come by anymore. If you're gonna stay at Teo's Inn, come by and play with me, okay? Speaking of Teo... Drivers and Blades. You're t you've come to cross the Dana Desert. Would you come and stay at my inn first? I don't have much to share with you, but will you let me do what I can? There's a reason I've been running this inn for the past 70 odd years, you know. I like helping folks. Please, come in. be Ornelia's former blade, would you? Ornelia? No, I'm... From the Territorial Defense Corps! It is you! What? Oh, I remember him well. Even though I was knee-high to a grasshopper back then. With that sword slung across your back, you were so cool. If you hadn't come when you did, our village would have been... Oh, yes! The house you used to live in is still out there on the outskirts. House? I'll check out the back. Good. How terribly desolate. I heard it's been 90 years, but... What is it? Did you remember something? No, it's nothing. Really? That's too bad. I would have liked to have learned about the old you. I am... Um... Who I am. I do not change. Uh! Laura, you okay? What happened? Uh, you, you got me right here. My heart's pounding! <laughs> like an asshole. But... That... That was such an awesome line! What? Jim, you didn't even realize, did you? Sometimes you'll say something and I'll just swoon. But... I don't think any girl could refuse you. N no. I yes. To... Yes, he did. No, -uh. you're smooth and you know it. Laura, 
What do you... Good times, smiling faces. It's her, right? Ornelia here. Yes. Yes, I think it is. Standing next to you, with such a goofy, blissful smile. It has to be, I'm sure of it. Are you? Hey, we should take a photo. Really? Of us together. Uh, I'm sorry. When did this become a group thing? Me and Jin? Come now, Laura. We all drink from the same well, don't we? That's a wise saying, I think. I don't think that's strictly applicable here. You can't have done this in secret anyway. I've never done this before. Feels nice. Your Majesty, if I may say, it's no time for levity. Aegean, relax. You should be open to new experiences. <sighs> oh, for... Who did we fall in with him? <laughs> okay, ready for the photo? Everyone say... Glarna! Glarna! That was before he risked her. How long have you been with Adam? Mm, three years, maybe? <sighs> One year with Mithra. When my village washed away in a flood, Adam was the one that helped us out. Right. So it wasn't the war then? No, it was. Resources were running low, so we stripped the mountain bare. That's what caused the flood. Hey, Laura. Hmm? You're looking for your mother, right? Did you get separated during the war? If only that were the case. Uh, there are some things you don't know about me. Uh, things? Tell me. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Mother used to work as hired help. When I was about ten, she was working as a maid. That was when Jin came into my life. You were a driver at ten. That's right. Things immediately turned bloody. I had to get out of there in a hurry. Seventeen years later, here I am. Wow, you don't look twenty-seven. I would have said twenty at most. <laughs> hey, flattery will get you everywhere. <laughs> well, just like me and Mick, I guess. Yeah, like plenty of kids out there. That's why I'd like to help, stand by them. Just like Jin always stood by me. It's almost more real than real family. Right, don't you think, Mick? What? No reaction. <laughs> I'm really trying here, you know. Ah, it's fine. He's smiling on the inside. Well, now, you can tell. Sort of. I see. Well, I'm feeling all inspired now. Just the spirit we'll need if we're going to set this world to rights. Yeah! Even Mithra is smiling. You can join in, you know. What's that? You don't need to ostracize yourself for being an Aegis. That's not what I'm... I happen to think you've got a lot going for you. You know? I mean, look at the if you... Should we really be bringing the kids along? Are you worried? Hmm. 
Allrest is a dangerous place right now. The war reaches everywhere. I'm sure we can keep them safe in a normal fight. But if... Where are you going? I want to speak with Adam. At this time of night? I'll see what he thinks about it. And if his mind is made up, there's still no harm done. talking about get out interloper monster hey quit it this is where i sleep it ain't your bed lady oh you're such a pain in everyone's bum you know that you simpleton hey wait a minute calm down both of you ow come on take it down no 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 no, no. what's all the noise something up um, it's probably better to sit this one out perhaps that's wise yeah maybe i'll just ask him tomorrow <laughs> something never change Morning. Ah, uh, um, uh, morning. <laughs> he has a fucking bump on his head. You're hurt. Are you okay? Uh, yes. I imagine I'll live. Sounded like quite a scene. Yes. Well, I was just collateral damage. Before. You said if you met a child in whom you saw something of yourself, you'd want to help them. I don't have the heart. Starting to, to think, really? I know. And they've got their own concerns. They want to create a place for themselves in this world. At their age, it's remarkable. I think it's on us to see they don't come to harm. Right. And what a charge it is. Alright, ready for a quick mosey across the desert. That is, assuming you've all got your medicine. Right here. Won't leave my side. How about you, Milton, Mikhail? But all good. I've been keeping tabs on him since this morning. Then, let's embrace the arid beauty of the Dana Desert. Be able to see the capital before long. Hope we won't get lost out there. We don't have the luxury. The capital needs to be informed of Malice's intentions as soon as possible. And let us make haste. Beyond endless dunes, recipe this? acquired. Look how far we've come. Oh, there's a treasure trove right here. Better be good. Hmm. Must. Some art stealth, maybe. Into the desert we go. The Brain Canyon. God, those guys are persistent. Can we use this? I know the drill. Hey, there's our entomology. If we must. You can see off in the distance. That giant tower is our ob objective. I do not remember the way there. Extra caution. 
what's here. I'm gonna uh, just do a little bit of wandering and pray. This thing I'm gonna have to fucking kill though. Oof. Oh, why did you switch off of a GM? Fine, it's fine, it's fine. Annoying, but fine. Why are you here? Oh, because everybody's dead. Adam, get the get the health pot. Adam, Mithra, thank God. Fuck. Oh, this is an issue. You need healing. I won't let us perish. That happened. I got plenty of orbs on him. It's good to know your but I could not for the life of me we'll stay alive. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you, Fire. We just need to get across Stena Desert and we'll be in Oresco, right? Right. The desert is a harsh place, but the palace is always visible. You can use it to orient yourself. It must be pretty enormous for us to be able to see it from such a distance. Don't try looking up when you're standing right in front of it, is all I'll say. Morning technology represents the high watermark in many domains. This type of skyscraping architecture is just one example. Yeah, then what's Adam doing with such a teeny little place back in Oleta? <laughs> Didn't expect to see you here, Fire. It's like... Stupid hours for you right now. Isn't it? You just woke up. You could go to 31. You could go to 30. You could go to 30. 8 a.m. is normal. Then I am misremembering time zones. Credit to my siblings in arms. I will grow stronger still. Well, that's because you work through the night, Patrick. That's different. Okay. For real this time, let's try to cross the desert. Again, that's because you work through the night. Okay. 
Golden Twin you Mesa. Must. That is an enemy that I don't want to fight right now. If I can help it. Ah, this Great is brick sand. This place would make a perfect base of operations. It's gonna hurt. That did not hurt as much as I expected. Can we use this? Helm Helm Pilgrim's Springland. That is a lot of goggles. An absolute fucking ton of them. We Jesus. Must. Don't want to fight you. Oh, fire. You shouldn't joke about that. Because knowing her, she may actually. Nice one. There's something here. There's something here. Nature makes a fine ally. There's a treasure trove out here. It has a field skill check on it. Level three lock picking. Jesus. Something here. I'm something of an expert. Anyway, welcome. Oh, thank God. Welcome to the Tornin capital of Oresco. That's not right. What's not right? This Titan. Why isn't it in its real form? You noticed. What do you mean? That isn't the original form of the Torn and Titan. In ancient times, the Torn and Titan held awesome power. Torna made use of that power to dominate all the rest for a thousand years. I was really only planning to get to Oresco. But the power was shut away in the reign of Electos the First. Since then, the Titan has looked like this. See that glowing sphere in the castle tower? That forms the sea. Is that what Malus is aiming for? Why would he do that? Wouldn't it be a threat to him too? Truthfully, I don't know myself. But in any case, if he makes a move for it, it is clear what we must do. Agreed. You can see the palace in the distance. We should head there first. Offer our report to his majesty. Ah, you're back. I didn't expect that from you, Fire. Or... What the fuck? <laughs> um... So, oh, again, welcome to Oresco. Tornin Capital. This front gate is locked, so we have to go around the side. Gives us a chance to go explore the city. 
We have a lot of stuff going on here in the in the shop. Shopping district, I should say. And a bunch of side quests all over the place, so we definitely Hey, we heard about you. Waitin. The guy who got the way tree named after him. We'll have to talk to him sometime. When we have more time on our hands. Got good music and it seems decently lively. This is an unfamiliar vista. Nice one. But for now, let's just go talk to the king. This is an Lord Odom and Your Majesty Emperor Hugo. I expect there must be some em of emergency. But Sir Malthus is also gracing us with his presidents. Please wait here, I'll inform the king you've arrived. That's right, you remembered. Malos aims for the seal? Yes. He draws ever closer to the capital. Leaving destruction in his wake. Our path here was littered with the wounds of his procession, my lord. So, the quester's report was true. Noble Hugo, at this time of grave peril, you have afforded us your trusty aid. Your due will be our eternal thanks. I'm scarcely worthy of it, your majesty. As the titans breathe, I merely followed Prince Adam against the peril we face. In truth, it is to him that your kind praise is due. Ah. The trust of the dread Ardanian throne. Tis a much valued gift to our young scion of a letter. Mark it well. It gladdens me. Your most noble honors pierce my unworthy heart, my lord. Begging your pardon, lord, would that honor were the only currency in this grave business. An armed band transgressed the sacred boundaries of the capital without regal assent. The act merits bitter punishment. Suppose you that our soldiers can subdue Malos alone? I... I don't... Indeed. The army of resistance fearlessly dashes to our nation's aid. They tremble not in the face of the mightiest of foes. To punish them is unthinkable. Yes, but... Zeta, what does not bend only breaks. We must suffer to Adam his just bounty. I hereby enfief you as Lord of Heblin. This is too much for me, my lord. First, I must busy myself with the command of the resistance force. We can't allow Malos to take the seal. I'd be much obliged if you could grant permission for the Resistance to move freely within your lands, Lord. As you wish. Brave soldiers of Torna, hear your king. Our country must make its own sacrifice to halt the terrible power of the Aegis. Indul too, pledges its flesh and blood to the cause. I humbly confess that it was my own lack of foresight which brought us to this pass. My brother, or rather, my lord, what is your aim? Why give Heblin to Adam? He has declined our offer. Perhaps our good wishes suffice. Yet still, he holds all the power. He makes allies of foreign lords without permission and gathers together a fighting force. <sighs> Zeta, my brother, hear me well. The sickened world rests heavy upon my crown, I fear too heavy for my mortal neck. M Majesty. And this disorderly throne. 
is more apt for one such as Adam. Brother, you mean to set my birthright on the caitiff's shoulders? Ah, I could finally breathe. What's wrong? You got asthma or something? It's alright, there's no need for concern. Lady Laura gets like this whenever she has to deal with formal situations. That's not ideal. If you're one to talk, you've been waiting outside the whole time just idling by yourself. That's so selfish. Cut him some slack, Laura. Renault had good reason not to go. Especially when his least favorite individual was attending. Least favorite? Wait, you mean Amalthus, don't you? I'm sorry, I didn't... Fine, I'm a coward, I admit it. Should endeavor to make the sure that Minoth steers well clear of the quester in the future. So, Adam, what's our next course of action? We may have warned them in time, but there's no telling of when Malos might launch his attack. Indeed, we could start by taking a stroll around the city and seeing what the residents have to say. You can't be serious. Malos is virtually breathing down our necks, and you want to waste time catching up? That's not what this is. We'd get to learn the lay of the land, too. And we'd get an idea of the overall mood. He's right. Establishing a good rapport with the residents will give us an edge when the time comes. Perhaps the Aegis feels that she can handle the situation all on her own. Fine, whatever. You all know better than me, so go on ahead. Bunch of bullies. I'm not saying it to be mean, Mithra. We all have to make concessions. And I think even you understand that now. Really matured, you know. Am I supposed to take that as a compliment? You should. Adam's been looking out for you this whole time. You know he's being honest. Agreed. You should take his praise at face value. Now, let's head to exploring the city. Plenty of atmosphere to soak up. Oh god, who just joined? Oh, okay. We're okay. New recipe acquired. The Quester. And with that... I'm going to call it here for the night. Next time, we'll be going around the city. And possibly some other areas as well. And seeing what we could do before we progress to the city. The story. Which... Community. Community. Fucking... Community. Good night. I hate community. So, so much. Most